have you ever wondered how we become who we are? Like today, something interesting popped into my mind. While I was in, in the kitchen, I was preparing something to eat and something just hit me in my head. I just, not, not something physical, obviously not, <laughs> but something just came to me. For a moment, I, it just, it just dawned on me that I was myself, or it, I just became aware of who I was in that moment, and it was, it was kind of a trippy moment because I was asking myself or thinking to myself, who am I, and how did I become? The person that I am. How did I end up here being this person, doing all these things, having all these thoughts and this, this outlook on life? How did I become this person? And I was trying to, to see if there was any direct correlation or if there was any direct link between what I remember myself being as a child and who I am today. Could someone looking at my infancy, could someone looking at my past or seeing me as a child predict that I would be the person that I am today? At what moment did I go down a path that brought me to where I am now? Why do I have the values that I have? Why do I view the world the way I view the world? Granted, I'm from a, a family and my parents, you know, they have their own outlook on the world. And yes, a lot of who I am, I would imagine has been influenced by a lot of that. But at the same time, what made me choose the things or choose to hold on to the things that I hold on to and embrace the things that I embrace? What's the role of nature and what's the role of nurture in determining who one becomes or what one becomes? You know, and, and to go to go in a very extreme sense, did the parents of presidents know that their children would become presidents? Or did the parents of murderers know that their children would become murderers? And what made that outcome possible? At what point did that person begin to veer or to go down a specific path? Was it something that gradually happened or was it just a snap? A lot of things that I found interesting when I was a little boy, I still find interesting to some degree to this day. But I don't believe that I would ever consider myself as responsible. I think, <laughs> I think when I look at myself as a kid, and I think probably all kids to some degree are like that, but I was notorious in my family for being easily distracted. I had a bunch of interests. I was all over the place. I found it difficult, I imagine, to really focus on one thing. There's a famous story where I would be tasked with throwing out the garbage and it would turn into something else. You know, I'd find something else that needed fixing and I would get distracted and move on to that. I would never imagine that the person who I am today had anything to do with the person that I was. At what point did I decide that I no longer want to procrastinate? At what point did I decide that I want to get better at focusing, get better at organizing, get better at managing? And I'm not sure if I have any answers. I remember I was washing the dishes and for a moment it felt so surreal that I am where I am and I'm doing the things that I'm doing almost without realizing that I got here. Like I'm aware of 
my history and my past but if one was to draw a line between your infancy and who you are right now would it be a straight line would it deviate at some point I don't know I just found that interesting and I, I couldn't help but think going back to the whole point of nature versus nurture given a different environment what might I become who might I have become if I never left my home country if I never met the friends that I I have if I didn't make certain pivotal decisions who would I be what would I be doing would I still persist and become the person I am if I was in an entirely hostile environment would who I am as a person shine through all of my surroundings or break through all of the things that would work to suppress what comes natural what made me choose to fight against some things that are natural because I have fought against things that feel natural in order to attain the things that I want I have fought against personality traits that I didn't find to be very useful I've been around good company and bad company at different phases of life what made me choose the things I chose 